The city of Hobbs is stepping in after discovering a woman's home crawling with wild cats. Police say they were all living in filth, and many of those cats are very sick. News 13 Selena Westervelt spoke with the homeowner this afternoon. This is one of the strays taken in by Shirley Jones. She says she loves her cats, but things just got out of hand and she became overwhelmed. I had to ask the Lord to help me find a way to, to uh, get rid of them. And I guess maybe this was the answer. Police were called to check on Jones Tuesday after a concerned citizen hadn't seen her for a while. When they entered her home, the officer said he found more than 50 cats, some of them pregnant. Shirley claims there were 20. The house was also littered with cat feces. I was, I was trying to love them. And two, I knew that I had heard that if you had cats, they would put you on the list. The Lee County Adoption Center was called in and Jones agreed to let them take away most of her cats. A city ordinance says she can have no more than five. My little stroker love, which is very lovable. My rougher, he's a male cat. He's facing get fixed. And then there's my skinny tail. The one she's keeping will be spayed and neutered. The city has a program to help Jones and others with the cost of those procedures. They're in a situation where um, feral cats or any of that situation is just overtaking them. I hope that they will reach out to us. Please go have them fixed. Please don't let it get out of hand. Please don't get up me. Willie Stone tells me a handful of cats have already been euthanized. The other ones will be evaluated for three to five days to determine if they can be adopted. In Hobbs, Selena Westervelt, KRQE News 13. Police say because Jones is cooperating with them and the Humane Society, she will not be cited.